What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to GazetteSports.com. It's JJ. And Zumi. And we're in Compton, where the Polly Jackrabbits are trying to get back on Victory Road after dropping a game at Mission Viejo last week. Also, trying to open up the Moore League with a win. Likewise, Compton wants to make a splash after a tough few weeks to open the season. Oh, it's been tumultuous to say the least. We go to the action. It's 14-8 in the third quarter. Compton playing a great first half. However... The quarterback carousel was the thing to watch. That's Nick Pope, number 11, trying to drive Polly for a score in the third. However, Compton's Trayvon Jackson comes up with a pick. This game was a comedy of errors. It really seemed like for every turnover, the team that just got the ball would give it right back. And here, Polly recovers a fumble inside the five-yard line. They would only get a field goal out of that possession. And to the sophomore, EJ Jackson, to take the snap. 14 hands it off to PJ Rounds. A lot of kids getting a lot of run they usually wouldn't get for Polly. That inexperience would show at times. That's Edgar Gadu gonna go for the big six. We got a ball game, folks. It's 17-14 with 2.38 left in the third. Enter Chase Hales. Big completion across the middle to Thomas Tucker. And then into the fourth quarter, Hales to Tucker again. This time a 24-yard strike for the touchdown. That would give Pauly a 10-point lead late in the fourth. So, you need the defense to make a play, and Jayon Brown comes up with a big one. That's going to force a punt and double thump. Brock Mickelberg, special team stud. Going to get that block, the safety, going to give the ball back to Hales, and he's going to give it to somebody you might recognize, basketball fans. Yeah, Rashawn Prince, the six foot five forward on the hardwood, making a name for himself on the gridiron this year. 25-yard touchdown to Rashawn Prince, beautiful. And then the interception to, by Taylor Flowers, going to give Hales and Prince another chance to hook up. Row P, so sweet. Three touchdowns and one safety for Polly in the fourth quarter alone turned this game from a real close contest into kind of a blowout. Fun to watch Ro P out there on the football field. Keep an eye out for that, fans. And then, of course, D block. Put the exclamation point on a 41 14 Polly victory. Very good game for Compton to stay in it for three quarters, but Polly showing just how powerful they are in the fourth. If you want to continue to follow both of these teams, as Polly looks for that consistent quarterback they've been searching for, then you stay right here, because at sports.com, we are Long Beach Sports.